Hey guys, it's Michelle. I'm just here again to do another very quick quick review with you guys. Now the wig I'm wearing at the moment is from the Cosmopolitan Collection by Gisela Mayer. The wig that I'm wearing, Cosmo Angel Special. And the colour that I'm wearing is 1001-23-14. I don't even know how to describe it. It's kind of super vibrant, modern, platinum, white silvery blonde, very very much white toned with darker writing. It is really really quite special. Now this wig is really pretty. It has an absolutely amazing, amazing lace front on it. Now let me just show you that before we actually begin. So let me call you a bit closer and show you the lace front on this here. So we have this wonderful lace front as you guys can see. What we do have with this wig is we have a left sided lace monofilament parting. So it will look like that hair is coming from your own scalp and that is really lovely to make it look more natural and it really does do that and I think the kind of the combination of the rooting that's on this hair and the fact that it does have this monofilament parting, this kind of lace parting down the left whereby it's clear, you can see your scalp through it. It does look like the hair is growing out your own head and it's just a wee bit overgrown and you need to get your roots done, which is really, really cool because it looks so, so natural. You wouldn't know it was a wig. Now the lace front on this, as you've already seen, it is very natural. This is a longer wig and the wig is pretty much straight until you get towards the last few inches, probably from just below mid length to the end. You have, it's not particularly curly curly, but you have these big loose beach wave type curls, almost like you've had a blown out blow dry sort of thing, do you know what I mean? Like a kind of blow dry, the hair dressers, the ends are curly, and it's all that kind of modern summery type way where you're going out and you're just kind of like, it's almost that way, I've not made any effort, but I actually have. <laughs> You've made an effort, but you don't want to look like you have made too much. So it's very, very natural looking, like as if you've just left your hair to dry by itself and the ends have gone all kind of swooped out, curly, wavy, and that's how it's dried in naturally. So it is very, very beautiful. Now there are a whole host of shades in this wig, so whether you are into this super vibrant, white, modern type shade, or whether you are looking for something a wee bit more natural looking, there will be something for you. There are different shades, so you're not kind of just stuck to this specific shade with this wig. You do have a choice that you can certainly make. Now, white is something that I would have never gone for in the past, if I'm totally honest with you. I would have, had I still had bio hair, I would have still been dying at jet black. I would have probably never done anything other than that until I hit about 125 years old. I didn't dye my hair jet black, blue black, forever. But um, I do have this kind of love for really ashy tone blondes or silvery white grey tones especially rooted ones. I do love them very, very much. So this is certainly a shade that I like and I do feel it is really, really beautiful. And it's just something different, you know, for me certainly it's different anyway. So if you're into that kind of modern, funky type look and you like your vibrant, bright shades, this could be something for you. And you know, the beauty is, your hair is not going to look damaged like as though you've had to bleach it to oblivion to achieve this shade because you literally put it on, you go and this is the look you're going to have. Now the density in this hair is really really natural, it's very beautiful and like for example if I show you this, this is part of the Cosmopolitan range. If I just pop that all behind my back, I'm going to do a wee quick turnaround actually and let you see it. So I have put it all behind my back just now, but if I turn it around, you will see the length in this. It is a lovely long wig. Now density wise, if I was to tie this up, this is going to look very, very natural right now because it's not particularly full. 
some wigs, I like a lot of the ends to in a wig but it can make it very difficult to tie up because it can look quite poofy and quite full. This doesn't have that, this looks very natural, I mean like there you go, there's just two seconds effort of me just scraping it back and it does look like how a ponytail would look in your head if you were growing hair and if I turn around I'm going to show you the kind of density of this ponytail. Woohoo! It's very beautiful. Now you could kind of pin that to the side, you could have that hair, Ooh. you can have that hair kind of hanging down to the side, you could have the whole thing kind of swept over to one side which is maybe more so what I would do. I probably have it all swept to one side and maybe pop a wee braid or something in here and just have it loosely at the sides. If I was going to be kind of semi tying it back and wearing it down I'd probably have it something like that or braided. I do love this routine and I think it's very natural because if you had bio hair to achieve this kind of super vibrant bright white platinum type blonde you would have to have a kind of lighter shade of hair to be able to do such a high lift on it um, and the fact that you do have roots but they're not pitch black does make it look very very natural it creates quite a contrast with the actual shade of hair and yet at the same time it's not like black and white sort of thing does that make sense anyway i hope this has been helpful for you guys i hope it's been beneficial Giselle and Mir have created some really amazing colors as of late they have some beautiful styles available i am very excited to see what more is going to come in the future whether you're looking for this type of shade or something a bit more natural or something vibrant in a different way then certainly check out the range available from Giselle Mir and the Cosmopolitan collection it is kinda cool. I love the lace front on this, I genuinely love the lace front on this wig and I love that kind of left monofilament lace parting that we have, it's very natural, creates such a great appearance and yeah, it gives a very affordable cost to the wig because the full top is not monofilament, it is just that kind of left parting. Um, the inside of this cap, let me just show you it quickly. So. We have this lace front, we have the parting, we have the kind of standard top, otherwise we've got wefts that are covered over, open wefted sides, back, velvet nape, we have these velvet ear tabs with metal stays inside, it's really just lovely, I do like this very much, this shade is one that I'm a bit of a lover of right now and... This wig was sent to me for purposes of doing a review. It's not my wig, I do not get to keep the wig. I am sending this back to Gisela Mayer. So, you know, anything that I say is totally my own opinion. I like the colour very much. In regard to colour and style, that's something that you need to decide yourself whether you're happy with. But certainly, this is the kind of colour that I love. I love the super white type blonde but with a kind of more natural root on it, that's something that I really love very much. So this might be one that I might end up purchasing myself at a later date. I do kind of have a bit of a soft spot for this one. Anyway guys, take care. Until next time, I'm going to be back soon with more wig reviews. I have a whole lot to do for you guys. I am mid process of editing other Gisela Mayer wig reviews and other brand wig reviews as well. So I'll be back very soon but until next time, look after yourself and just remember that you're so special. There is only one of you in this world and that is actually amazing and when you think about it, it really truly is phenomenal because you are unique. And so yeah, until next time, keep sparkling, be your own beautiful. I will see you all very soon with another wig review. So take care and lots of love until we meet again. <laughs>